tell you, uh, I've actually been agonizing over writing a speech for weeks. Uh, it's been in the back of my mind every day at school, every minute of work, every second I sat with my friends. How do you put down on paper over 13 years of memories? What justice does paper do to the late nights, the parties, the swimming pools, the classrooms, the big toy? What I'm here to do, here today to do, is tell you how we're done. But before that, I'm here to make you remember what got us here. The path that led us from tinker toys to graphing calculators, diapers to caps and gowns. It is an honor and a privilege to stand before you today as class president and salutatorian. I have confidence in saying that this is one of the greatest classes to pass through the halls at St. High School. We are students, we are fans, we are artists and writers. We play sports, we play music, but above all, we are friends. And that, I believe, is what makes us special. I turn around and I see faces that I saw on the first day of kindergarten, every day at recess, on field trips and at pool parties. I turn around today and I see caps and gowns, graduation parties, prom, calculus and physics, and adults. Whether we're going out to design super lasers in the labs of MIT or edit the next bestseller at Worcester, whether we're going to cure mental illness or read massive amounts of poetry at Ohio State, whether tomorrow we'll have us rehabilitating people at OU or scoring goals at Ohio Dominican, we're moving forward and tomorrow will bring us new opportunities. What we're here for today are diplomas, but what we're here to do is close the book on the longest chapter of our lives. Our colors will forever be blue and white. Our paths started here, and although they may not cross again until sometime between tomorrow and someday, we'll know that the future began on this stage. The students before you owe a debt of gratitude to the teachers behind them. We support our teachers, and I have confidence in saying that I received one of the finest educations in the county. I'd first like to thank Mr. Mayberry for his support over the last two years and for putting on one of the best proms Angel High School has ever seen. Second, I want to thank Mr. Dowdy and Ms. Porter for their extraordinary charisma in the classroom and the guidance they provided as class advisors. Finally, I have to thank Dr. Stewart and Mrs. Forms, whose undying passion for mathematics and science helped me discover what I want to do for the rest of my life. I know this seems all mushy here she so far and that our teachers sound pretty serious, but I've heard some pretty crazy things over the years, and oddly most of it was from these teachers. For Mr. Downer, don't erase it, I'm going to erase it with his head. <laughs> I always thought it was cool to stick my hands in a hot dead animal. <laughs> For Mr. Fry, I love bagels and peanut butter, but I ran out of peanut butter. <laughs> and finally, Mr. Fitzum, that Burger King guy scares the crap out of me. <laughs> but I've also heard teachers say things like, this is my favorite class of the day. And I love you kids like you're my own. And this isn't work, this is what I love. So thank you to the teachers whose hard work and dedication have made ZHS feel like home. I'm happy to be where I am right now, standing amongst friends and teachers and family who have helped so many of us get to where we are today. This is the first day of the rest of our lives, where we step away from childhood games in the playground and become adults in the changing world. Yesterday is a faded memory and a voice in the distance we can't go back to it, but we can allow its memory to remain alive in our hearts and our minds by keeping in touch with each other. Though the places we are going are far and wide, we are moving together, step by step, toward a future where we shape lives and shape the world. I'm sad that yesterday has passed, that high school is over, but I'm excited that, at the thought of the people I'll meet. I'm excited to hear of my friend's success, and most of all, I'm excited to step forward into a future molded by our past. Thank you, Saintsville High School, and thank you, Class of